Now from the night team, parents and students at a West Valley High School are on edge, demanding answers after a threat posted on social media calling for targeted cer targeting certain groups with an AK-47. School leaders say the threat does not appear to be credible, but parents are understandably concerned about specific details that were used in the threat. Team 12's Jonathan McCall picks up the story from there. At Greenway High, where excellence runs green and gold, some parents are now seeing red. I will be shooting Greenway High School up with my AK-47. Those words, part of a chilling Instagram story discovered Tuesday, threatening to shoot Greenway school administrators and the freshman class, while also providing details on the easiest way to get inside of the school. Eric Bohal is a freshman. Soon I saw the, um, the story that he posted on Instagram, and him going into specifics, like, you know, bringing an AK-47 to the school, uh, targeting the freshman class, you know, it kind of frightened me. Eric's dad. And we should be having uh, more detailed information rather than these vague emails. And other parents say they're fed up and frustrated with the clarity from school leaders about that threat. Put the parents' minds and students' minds at ease. School officials did send a letter notifying parents of the threat Tuesday. A follow-up letter coming Wednesday morning after the school day had already started saying the threat wasn't credible. Shannon Bocchini wonders how. How did they determine that? What's the investigation? Is the person uh, known? With her two freshmen attending the school. It's scary. Um, that account followed me. I'm one of the, I think, 54 people that it's following. And... So it's not following a lot of people, so that's kind of scary too. She's kept them home during finals week, rather to be safe than sorry. It's better missing a week of school than not having them for the rest of their lives. 12 News reaching out to Greenway High for comment, but so far we have yet to hear back. Jonathan McCall, 12 News. Okay, Jonathan.